Yo, what's up, you guys? Welcome back to my channel. We are here with another reaction video, and you also already know you're here with your girl, Chanel. All right, so the first things first. If you aren't already liking and subscribing, what are you waiting on? Seriously, don't make me have to say it again. <laughs> No, but for real. Make sure y'all like and subscribe, you guys. Leave me some comments. Leave me some videos to react to. So, we'd like to react to Trap Terrell's Deadbeat Mom. I'm really uh, ready to see this one. Let's get this set up. I'm ready to see it. I have definitely heard it recorded, but I just didn't get to watch it. So, let's watch it. Deadbeat moms. Y'all know any out there? I know some deadbeat daddies. I know a few deadbeat moms too. Ooh. Hey, what do you need? Bitch, what? I know I'm the dad, but you act like you ain't carrying this seed. Just gonna disappear, act like you was carrying me. Real. We was a family. Uh, now you can't stay me. Uh, Beat you a deadbeat parent. Uh, uh, we pregnant tested. Right. Boy, and I learned a lesson. I should be trying to sue that best western. I should. <laughs> but I went legend. I'm talking. First of all, Mary J, why you got the shades on? Girl, take them shades off. We is inside. What you, what you tired of? You ain't got the kid. You deadbeat. Basically, she should have just been all up in here with it. All up in here with it. Respect. This is the shit that I get from sex with you. No bitch, I said it correct. This is the shit that I get cause sex was cool. No nigga get it correct. This is the shit that I get cause sex was cool with you. You trash. Can't believe I did your ass. Fuck you, bitch. Well, you did. Right. Now let's talk about my kid. I want some child support. Uh -huh. But we'll go to trial and court. Right. We'll go to trial and court. Uh. In style, of course. It's your child. You need a course. No it's your child. But you forced. No you quitting jobs and shit. Stupid. Quit quitting jobs, little bitch. That's crazy. Listen, that is real life issues. That is real life issues. If I don't know nothing else, I would know. <laughs> That quitting the job so you don't got to pay the child support it is below bum behavior because why? Just pay it. Now, I'm not speaking for the females who are putting their men on child support because and vindictively. I'm not. I'm speaking for the regular crap that they be going on. There should be something against you quitting a job. For the child. They should come lock you up if you quit the job. But they start garnishing. Because, I mean, if you've been paying it, you would have been all right in the first place. But it's like, dang, so you're going to stop. You ain't going to pay a child support. You're going to stop your income? You don't want nothing? Like, you don't want to eat? <laughs> I pay no bills? Like, what's, what's, what's going on? I find you, chick. Not lately. I got no time for this. No I'm here for the highest bid. No Cause you got no time for kids. No you got no time for kids. No but you got some time for this. And you know you do. Mm. The only reason you don't want the kid cause I don't want to be with you. Me and that shit evil, but that's what demons do. If you're not with that it, that's what like And this shit mess with, that's what semen do. Should've just hit from the back. I baby needed you. Why you worry about my girl? Why? You 
You should worry about your child. Right. You should ask about your kid. Right. You ain't seen her in a while. Right. Y'all ain't talked in a minute. Right. You say you called, no, you didn't. Nah, I did when you went to Detroit. Right. Baby, you missing the point. Man, you don't kid need more yeah. than that. You got a daughter, she don't. Oh, oh, man. Oh, man, I'm at y'all. That's crazy. They cannot find you, chick. Not lately. I got no time Who's for this. Who's talking about him? I'm here for the highest, bitch. No Because you got no time for kids. No babies. You got no time for kids. No babies. But you got some time for this. And you know you do. The only reason you don't want the kid because I don't want to be with you. You can't even object. And that shit means what that's what demons do. <laughs> don't they? And Won't shit, they? That's what, that's what semen do. Why you worry about my girl? Why? You should worry about your child. Right. You should ask about your kid. Right. You ain't seen her in a while. Y'all ain't talked in a minute. Man, I couldn't imagine going long, a long period of time not talking to my baby. Okay, which she's about to be 12, so she's not that uh, a baby anymore. But still, when she went on this church camp thing for like, five days and they didn't have phones it was just you know i mean they have phones but they can only use like once a day anyway it messed with me i couldn't talk to my baby because what you doing i mean i know you ain't camp but what you doing and i know i i am one of them mothers so i couldn't imagine don't y'all deadbeats out there who be going weeks months years not talking to your kid how like, you don't feel nothing? You don't feel nothing? You say you called, no, you didn't. Nah, I did when you went to Detroit. <laughs> Baby, you missing the point. Man, you don't kid need more than that. You got a daughter, she don't want to be a quarterback. And I'm a man. It can't get harder than that. I got a plan, but her mama should be starting now. I'm just saying. Real. It's stuff I can't prepare. Yeah. I can teach her that she's beautiful, but it still make up in hair. You don't get it. Yeah. I can tell by your face you dip. You dip. Wanna tell you to your face you trip. You trip. Just look at the face you dip. You don't get it. But you will like the cooties. You acting like that cause you think there's a movie. My baby don't need to salute me and shoot me. Damn, be. Dang, just gonna sign over the custody. Sorry. Could you imagine this half a sign over? The, this half of them signed over the custody. Ooh, you a different type of deadbeat mom. You a different type of because I couldn't imagine. I couldn't imagine baking something and then birthing it and then just not being there. I love being a mom. I love being a mom. Is it tiring? Yes. And I have a girl. We get to that preteen stage, you know, where you know you got to start really giving that eye, giving them talks. Because, girl, <laughs> with an attitude. But I couldn't imagine being a deadbeat. You know, and I, I want to raise the importance of um, it takes both, you know, both roles are equally important. I love how he um, went at it from a male point of view. We do not see that often in society. We don't. And we know it happens. It happens. I'm sure it happens. I, I don't know if I know anyone personally like that. I mean, I know him, but I don't know how he how he feeling about it. I don't know the guy. But, um, I think that's dope to come from a male point of view about being a deadbeat parent. Because we don't get to hear it often. We don't get to hear it. And they have a voice too. So, any fathers, all the fathers out there who are actually being fathers, taking care of y'all kids, I salute y'all. Thank y'all. Keep doing y'all thing. Keep taking care of these babies. I supposed to been stop this video. Y'all ain't said nothing. Mm-hmm. But um, definitely keep doing y'all thing. Definitely keep supporting these babies because they need it. They need it.
All right, you guys. Y'all leave me some comments. Tell me what y'all think. Y'all got a couple of uh, fathers out there going through that. Let me know how y'all handle it. Y'all do the whole custody thing that y'all like. Let me know. I know y'all got some stories out there for me. I, I, I know y'all about tired of listening to me. I want to read y'all situations, okay? So, if you haven't already, like and subscribe. Also, follow me on all social media platforms. That's she.chanel, all right? And until next time, I will talk to you later. Mm -hmm.